Hi everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm cramming them in today, um, but they're not going on today. So I don't know why I said that. I'm just cramming them in on a day, doing the videos. Then I've got to edit them over a certain amount of time and get them out and get a more regular routine and get a load done in one fell swoop. Uh, so hopefully I won't have a huge long time away like I did recently. Um, this is Dark Sarah. This was uh, requested by Orin. Cor I've, I've butchered the word. I could type it in and put it on the thing. I got fed up with doing that. I, uh, I like the ch I like the challenge of butchering words uh, because you know words are there to be destroyed by idiots, and that's me. And he, uh, she, it, whatever they want to classify themselves as, uh, requested uh, sky sailing as maybe something I might want to listen to. Um, said so it's uh, it's a bit different it's an interesting concept uh, I'm not sure about concept uh, I enjoy uh, music more than anything else than um, storylines and lyrics etc I don't mind that I, you know, I like the lyrics I like the storylines etc but it's always the music that has to hit me first if the storylines wonderful and the music isn't then uh, it doesn't go anywhere for me but the thing about Dark Sarah is I've listened to a couple of their songs now and they've been like whoa I mean, they do take you on a journey. They are they are storytellers, even through their videos, through their music, and through their lyrics. But uh, lyrics, like I say, that's the lesser side for me until I've clicked on the music. Then I tend to uh, read the lyrics, learn the lyrics a little bit if it's a song I really like, uh, so I can go sing along. Um, so they always come secondary, and especially because um, lyrics, even though I like voices in songs, I like the vocals in songs, they don't always click with me. I don't always know what they're saying. Um, it doesn't matter how their voice sounds. Sometimes it's like, I don't know what they said. Uh, not on first listening anyway. Um, so all those people out there who do like lyric videos and stuff and they go, like, I know what they do. You know, they've got the lyrics up and they've, they've probably studied the lyrics long beforehand as well, uh, which is a little bit of a cheat, I think. But hey, it's their USP. Why not do it? Um, me, I don't do the lyrics. I just enjoy the music because it's the music that matters. Uh, so without further ado, let's go. Oh, oh! Yeah, it was that sort of way.
so many of my fierce minds begin with you you're one of a kind so many of my you happy days i have shared with you Another huge story, another huge epic style, bombastic play of the day from Dark Sarah Sky Sailing. Start off with two criticisms, though. Two criticisms that they are desperate, but you know. One, keyboards is a huge part of their, you know, the soundscapes and the keyboards and things. There's nobody there showing playing keyboards. They obviously have a keyboard player. They obviously know how to play keyboards. Um, they should have a keyboard player showing there, or at least somebody create, you know, on there. It just feels weird to me when bands have keyboards as quite a dominant element um, to their stuff and they don't show anybody playing the keyboards. I don't know if one of the vocalists uh, is the keyboard player, if one of the guitarists, etc., plays keyboards as well, but they could easily show them playing the keyboards. It's just just a bugbear really in these kind of videos um, it's not so it's not really a criticism of the song it's just a criticism of how they show the video uh, the other one is the vocals as you know I, I said I'm not really invested in understanding the lyrics until I get used to the song um, it's always the music that matters first but vocals are part of that song they are part of that mix and they need to be easily hear, heard um, I feel that on this song, I mean, some songs, of course, they can be there like going, hello, and it could be part of what they want to do, but they feel a bit low in the mix on this. They feel like they sh the way the song is structured, it is much more bombastic vocal performance kind of song. Uh, all their songs are very much storytelling, and in this one, the uh, vocals feel a little like, squashed down a bit. They don't feel like they're quite at the same, even at the same level as the music, they feel like they're slightly under it. Um, even when the music died down, the vocal on the quiet part still felt quite low. Um, it's very weird to me that they were that low. They should have been, they feel like they should have been for this kind of music, the feature of the song. The most powerful part of the song. Not overwhelming it so that the music was like gone. But I mean, they should have been elevated slightly above the music, and it feels like they weren't so much. But um, that's my my gripe uh, for this song, really. Other than that, um, the other songs have felt like um, steampunk land. They have felt like you know, sort of Renaissance France style land. This time, this is a pirate one. They definitely uh, they definitely go through 
adventures, adventures in the past, um, the romantic adventures in the past as well. Um, very interesting, very fun. Um, after the quiet part, when they went back to the uh, more bombastic part again, it felt a lot stronger than it did before. But that's probably because um, we'd had the quiet part to re-elevate it up. Um, I enjoyed it a lot. It's not my favourite Doc Sarah song, I have to say, but after one, it's only after one listen. Um, and it might be because I'm going like, oh, the lyrics, are, the vocals aren't, aren't that high in the mix. Why? Um, and they felt higher than the other songs that I listened to. That might be it. Might be it. I still enjoy it a lot. They they still have they have real something about them, real adventure about them, real fun uh, thing about them. You can't quite put your finger on what they've got, but they've got something definitely. I really like it. Really like it. Um, have to hear more, won't I? I've heard a few now. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Uh, I might come across one I really dislike. Of course, some people right now will be moaning at me because I've criticised the song for very for a couple of elements. Um, but that's how I feel about it. I don't know how you feel about it. Do you agree with me? Do you totally disagree? Do you say, no, that's the way it should be? Uh, just let me know in the comments. I don't mind a debate. It's the, this is so stupid, sort of ones that I... What's the point? But anyway, actually, there's a point. You can still comment that, because comments give me YouTube credit, apparently. Any comment. So, so don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment. And I will see you again. Bye.